For October? Yes. Yeah, well, that's we the Astros. Are in September, we're about to win Are you talking about game. when they cheat or don't cheat? Sir, our and Astro never. Yeah, they did. They got caught cheated. cheating. They were stealing signs. Oh. Didn't they? Yeah. You mean like banging on the trash can? Oh, banging on the trash can? I don't think so. I, I'll tell you what. The cheating is not good. Oh, you have a nickname? We need a nickname. A nickname? A nickname. Well, they call me. Is that really a nickname? Mm -hmm. uh, I guess. Uh, I don't think so. I think you just gave away your name. We're going to have to squelch that out. Uh, you don't have a real nickname, Jenny. Do you know a nickname we can use? Stro. No, Jenny, everything's <laughs> Astro. Everything's Astro. Well, everything. Well, it is with me, too. I don't miss a game on, yeah. on TV. <laughs> Yay! We're just going to call you uh, Ashley. Come on up here, Ashley. Miss Ashley, right yeah, up to name. the table, yes. Yeah. She's just, Ashley has just come in with a lot of swelling on the lip. Why don't you go ahead and lie back down, buddy? You said this started three days ago on Tuesday? I believe it was Tuesday. Mm -hmm. I don't think it was Wednesday. And you've been working on trying, Jenny, what, are you recording? Yes, sir. Okay. Just want to be sure. You've been working on trying to get this to drain a little bit. You've been mashing on it some, right? I did mash on it some, yes, with yeah. the hot compact. And you did, okay, so you didn't just squeeze it. You put a hot compress on it and squeezed through that? Mm-hmm. Oh, well, yeah, it'd be okay if you just squeezed it. I mean, it did kind of come out at one time a little oh, bit. Oh, really? Okay. Jenny, come over here. You can probably see better. But it wasn't really nothing hardly. Look at Ashley here. Look at our upper lip here. You can see uh, we've got a a punctum, yes. right? And also, this is all very hot and it's very swollen, right? And you, mm -hmm. you're not having anxiety right now, are you? Well, no, I haven't really been too anxious. Just, well, it's well, just a little I, pain there. I mean, it does hurt. Yeah. I think it'll feel better if we get it to drain, don't you? Oh, well, I hope so. I do too. I do too. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. I'm gonna get to work here in just a moment. First thing I'm gonna do is open up an alcohol swab. And I'm just gonna lightly, right there. I see it very well. Do you? Good. Yes, sir. Good. That probably hurts just doing that, doesn't it? And so we're gonna use an 18 gauge needle and we're just gonna open that up a little bit so it can drain. And you didn't but I see have some cold spray. You didn't see anything in the inside. Well, there, did you? I didn't really want to mash, mash around a whole lot until okay. I got that to drain some because right. okay. I didn't want her. Now I need you to close your eyes tightly, okay? Jenny, can you see? Just I'm gonna spray some anyway. cold spray. Actually, are you ready? You just go to your happy place. You tell me when you're ready. You ready, love? No, she's not ready. Let her get ready. Oh, okay. You ready? Yes. Okay, cold spray first. Here it goes. Right there, a little chilly. Ooh, that's cold, huh? Mm. Okay, and then a little stick. Are you ready? Yeah, Here we go, a little stick. Good. You still, Miss Ashley. Don't wow. move, don't move, don't move. I'm just going to hold that needle. Now yes, it's draining a little mm -hmm. bit. Can you still see, Jenny? Yes. Yeah, all right. I can see very we good. don't want to take a scalpel and and really just. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, deep breath, deep breath. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, oh, yes. Jenny, look at that. Yes, sir. Ashley, you're not going to believe what is coming out of your lip. I bet it's going to feel so much better. Mm -hmm. God, it hurts. I know. We'll get you some antibiotics and something <laughs> for pain. Oh my goodness. Okay, you want to open up so you can see. How much came out? Whole bunch. See mm -hmm. that? Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to do warm compresses, right? We don't want this to close back up. We want it to keep on draining. See, I'm just putting just a, does that hurt a lot or just a little bit? No, it's fine. Yeah, see? So by doing that, you it's actually like, yeah, draining. Say, yes. It's actually still draining. I'm going to come around like this and just give it a little push on the other side too. Not real severe, just gentle because this is actually causing that pus to come out. Yeah, mm. oh my goodness. Mm. You have a lot more in there. It looked like two hands. Oh. 
It looks like two hands. Yeah. Are you getting it real? That's another hand. You got a good picture? Yes, sir. Yeah. I'm so glad you came yeah, in. This would have gotten so bad, you would have gone to the emergency room. Oh my goodness, we got more out, almost almost twice as much as we started with now. Okay, all right, well, oh my goodness, oh, look yes. at that, Jenny. See, I, see that yes, abscess goes yes. all the way in here. Mm -hmm. You're not gonna believe this, Ashley. Mm -hmm. Do you ever look at YouTube videos? You may wanna see this one. You've gotta see this one. Yeah, it's pretty impressive, it's gonna be impressive. Look at that, it's a pearl. Yes. Okay, we've got a whole bunch more. We're just gonna do that again, Jenny. What do you think? Yes, sir. Yeah. yeah. Pooping in my gut wound. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It is definitely gonna be, it's it probably already feeling a lot better. It's not nearly as swollen. But there's still more in there. No, I can still pull the knot, kind of. Yeah, well, you've got a lot of swelling that's not abscess. It's just what we call induration. Okay, a little bit of a... I can, I'm pushing a lot more now than I did before, and you're not, you're not wincing as much. That probably hurt a little bit, huh? Okay, and then let's just try one more time here. More? Yeah, it's just yes. kind of working its way in there. See, it would be tempting to take a, you know, 11 blade scalpel and just right. make a make an incision here, but I don't want to put a scar on your lip for this. You should have come in before, my goodness. This wow. must have really been hurting. You, it, it has had, for an, something as small as a lip to get as much us oh. out as we've gotten out there, that's just, that had to be hurting a lot. What do you think, Jenny? Yes, sir. I think we're almost there. Let me get you open up a little bit. I'm gonna come right in. And I want to feel underneath in there. So it's got the same kind of yes, swelling sir. underneath yes, this. Yes. Oh, oh, careful. Yeah, there's more in there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead. We have another needle if you need it. Yes, I can give it to you. In the sharp box. Okay, let's open up again. Right there. I'm gonna try not to push too hard, Jenny. Oh, you don't okay. need to because it's coming out. It's just out, coming, coming out yes. slowly. Yeah, we don't have to be in a hurry, do we? No, no. Poor Ashley, have you had fevers? I know you can't talk because I've got my fingers <laughs> under your lip here. I was thinking maybe you would nod. Have you had fevers though? Um, I can just feel it. It's, this has been very hot, just but right. I haven't had fever. Just hot around in this area here. Mm -hmm. The swelling is totally so much better. Yeah, it's a lot better. Yeah, I think we're getting toward the oh, end there. Yeah, getting toward the end. And actually, it's going to punch me right in the nose oh, here. In a I think we're done, okay? I, th I don't think there's a lot more. But I want you to, just like I was gently kind of pushing on it while it was, it's been draining, I want you to do that when you do the warm compresses, okay? Can you do that for us? Wow, that looks like so much better. Yes. There's still, there's still a lot of swelling, but it looks so, so much, much better. So much better compared to when she first came in. Bless your pain. Bless your heart. I'm going to give you something for pain, and we're going to get you antibiotics. I'm going to have Jenny come back in in just a moment and give you an antibiotic injection. Actually, like the extra strength Tylenol and stuff has been helping for like the... I mean, I don't know what you're going to give me for pain, but... If you don't want anything, we won't, but I need you to put a little pressure on that when you, when you do the warm compresses. Um, I don't know, unless you okay, do something like an ibuprofen type. You can take that right over the counter. You don't need a prescription. Yeah, okay. That's fine. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get you uh, an antibiotic injection to start with. Okay? I don't know what caused that. Well... I think mm -hmm. you got a little staph infection that got started somehow because mm -hmm. it looked like staph and it just festered, right? I don't think you did anything wrong. I don't think you did bit me either. I don't think so. I'm not going to say it's impossible. It doesn't no. look like a spider bite. Okay. It just feels like a Because I thought maybe that might have been what it was. I knew it wasn't like, my daughter said it could have been like a hair, you know how sometimes they get underneath there and well, ingrown hair, uh, ingrown hairs occur, but usually not on the lip right there. There are no hairs right there. 
Yeah, I didn't think there was. Yeah. All right. <laughs> well, thank you for letting us video that, and uh, I'll get you some medicine, okay? Okay. Hey, folks. You spoke, and we listened. Here's what you had to say about Meta7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And it could actually help you lose weight. Now, I haven't taken a nap in six months. That's right, Meta7. More and more people are sending in their testimonials. Weight loss, more energy, and generally feeling more alert during the day. Let's hear more. I used it to help wean myself off caffeine and energy drinks, and my productivity has been very high lately. It's natural, it's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm not tired during the day. I've worked 12 hour shifts. Just go, go, go all day. It makes me feel great, I love it, and um, take it. It's wonderful stuff. If you haven't tried Meta7 yet, it's time to order yours from Amazon. Time to boost your metabolism and kick your energy level into high gear. There's an Amazon link in the description.